Testing more. <gasps> I have been lied to. As your resident stationary experts, we've seen it all. Disappearing ink? Check. Erasers that look like sushi? Check. Pens made from seashells? Double check. That being said, we still found some weird pens that had us shook. But keep watching if you want to see me react to these weird pens. <laughs> the weirdest pens ever? Question mark, exclamation point. <laughs> So let's begin with okay. uh, envelope number one. Oh, these are the taper. These are the taper well, ones. You knew just by shape. I knew them by shape. These are the sweet taper. They're highlighters. They have scents. I've never actually smelled them. We're, we're going to do that. Okay. Uh, but first, yes. I would like to show you an actual tapir. Oh, there's... So yes, please. Oh my god! It's friend shaped. It, I just wanna. Oh, I just wanna squeeze it. I'm not gonna squeeze it, but I just wanna squeeze it. Can you hold up the highlighter and like compare oh, oh, oh. the shape? The. Right. Am I smelling them? I'm starting with melon soda. I'll turn it towards. Oh my. All right, I gotta stop. <laughs> Can you describe it? It's it smells like melon. So it's sweet. It's like it's like sweet, sweet vanilla. It's like really good. It's like frosting cake. How do you get work done if you have these highlighters? Okay, question. Uh -huh. After I highlight, does the paper smell? I believe it does. Okay, we're gonna move on. <laughs> sweet potato is purple. Like ube. <gasps> it's savory in a way. I don't even. Okay, cookie, ready? Mm -hmm. I wanna compare it to vanilla. All right, that's vanilla. Cookie is more, they are similar, but not the same. This is like my, me buying different shades of blue black ink and saying they're similar, but different, but I still wanna own all of them. You know what I mean? Mint, PS. Let me know in the comments below, Are you, do you like mint chocolate chip? Because I like mint chocolate chip, but I know people that say that it's like toothpaste. It's not like eating toothpaste. It tastes good. It's like sweet mint. It's like, uh, it's not toothpastey. I can tell you that much. I'm gonna, like, <laughs> I'm gonna like stick this thing up my nose. Don't do that. <laughs> I will, warning, if you buy these highlighters, don't. Don't do that. You know not to do that. Do I know not to do that? Peach. Y'all. So which scent is your favorite? Hold on, I gotta go through them all again. <laughs> <laughs> it smells so, okay, yeah, no. Sweet potato. Sweet potato is my favorite. Bing. Bing. <laughs> Ready? Okay. On a do set. There are a lot of them in here. What? Y'all, what is this? Hold, please. Putting this down. This is the created by Iconic double line. Hold the phone. It shows you. It shows you what it do. So what I'm seeing is, let me uncap it. <laughs> it looks like, can you, can they see? No, they can, it's too big. I'll cut two zoom in. Okay. It is what it says, double line. So the one, there's one tip that's pink, that's one tip that's purple. So you can choose to use both tips or one tip based on how you're angling your pen. I, or dot, oh, there's a dot. I don't mean to give you the finger. There's a dot. You could dot, or oh, I just like, I'm getting ahead of myself. 
I like the design of the pen because it shows you all the things you could do with this pen. And I like that it shows you the example of the thing, which obviously I'm going to try, but it won't look as nice because my handwriting is awful, but I will still try for you. I think we only have time to try one color. <sighs> Fine. Okay, we'll go with the cotton candy. We'll go with the pink and sky blue. I don't hold the pe my pen correctly. I don't hold my pen correctly. I don't need you coming for me. All right? You understand me? All right, here we go. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Oh, yeah, mm hmm. That's that good stuff. Yep, yep, yep. I don't know what it is. It's like the 3D effect almost. You know what I mean? Oh, sorry, I'm not holding still. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> it's like 3D almost. Just the old school 3D glasses. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Back in my day. I know you kids can just go to the movie theater, you put the glasses over your glasses and then it does the thing. But when I was a child, things had to look like this. <laughs> I like that. And I like these color combinations. Ready? Yep. Okay. Looking away. Oh, there are more in here. Looking. Kokio Beetles. Oh! These are excellent highlighters. I don't own any, but I can recommend them to you. It says, Beetle Tip 3-Way Marker. Double, sharp, bold. I have five colors. Your highlighting game is about to go through the roof. You are not physically prepared for how, just how good your highlighting game will be. Okay, ready children? Gather around, it's story time. Okay, the little tip on this side, you can use for underlining. The bold side here, you can use for straight up regular highlighting. The coup de gras. You can turn the pen and have it so that the fine tip and the bold tip, they like there's a line on top and a line below your text. When I saw this on jet pens before I worked here, I was like, there's, who thought of that? And low key, my favorite part is there's like a little beetle. Cause it's like the end, you know. You know, I don't have to. This is when I'll uh, pop up a picture of a beetle. Deal or no deal? Deal, yes, I want all the stationery. Ready? Yep. Okay, looking away. What is this? What is this? All right, I'm just gonna take it out of the envelope. What is this? I'm just gonna try and open it. Here we go. <gasps> I'm speechless. Why is it, uh, what's, eh, 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 you know what I mean. So why, why do you think the nib or the tip is the way it is? Other than to puncture something, eh, 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 I really don't, I don't understand. So you use it, um, say you needed to hang a shelf and uh, you need to mark on the wall where to drill. If the hole in the shelf is too narrow or too deep for a regular pen, you could use this pen instead to mark it. So it's, it's a very specific function. That's why there's like a inside the, I like that it has a clip can, you know. I, this confused me. I was so excited and now I'm confused. <laughs> oh no! Oh! Okay, I'm not looking. I'm gonna crouch and I'm gonna look and I'm just gonna reach. Hello, are we ready? I need to investigate further. Hold, please. Am I saying ninny pie or am I saying ninny p a? I guess ninny p. Ni ninny p. Yeah. It looks like ninny pie. Don't be confused though. 
They're made by Sunstar. It says pen and marker. Are these new? Relatively. Okay. These are new to me. These are new to you. Are you ready? What is this? Opening. Why are they? I know why. At first, I was like, why is the nib of the pen part at an angle? It's askew. If you saw this, you'd be like, something went wrong in production. Send all of these back or send them to my house. <laughs> Look at it. It's because when you're angling and when you're writing, you don't want it to be straight. You want it to be angled so that when you're writing, this way you're not worried about the highlighter marker also doing what it do. Testing more. <gasps> I have been lied to. Josh, you didn't say this was gonna happen to me. This is the green one. It wrote in like coral pink and now if you look, they're, they're uh, color oh. pairings. It shows it on the thing. I should have known where the fine line is coral pink. And then this is mint green. Or did you want to oh. have more thoughts? Again, one more time. This is the Sunstar Nini... Nini P. Nini... Nini P. Nini. Nini, Nini P. Yeah. Nini P. Do I need these? Add them to your wish list or just buy them straight up. Let's get it. Go back up to the mic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Which one was your favorite? Let me know in the comments. Oh, it's askew. I have to fix it. Which one was your favorite? My fa Oh, my favorite? Mm -hmm. My heart says the sweet tapir because we just, just one more. My heart says, wow, sweet potato. You weren't expecting that. I wasn't expecting that. So good. But my head says the cocoa beetle tip because oh, it's so good. It's just so smart. Like we can do it. We have the technology. That's what my head says. Are there any other weird pens or other stationary items you want us to react to? Let us know in the comments below. You can shop all these pens, which you just saw, and more at Japan'sLock. That was pretty good too. <laughs> I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Finger guns! <laughs> <laughs>